the um, pass out of the coconuts. Okay? We presume we've been saying that we're actually in some survival yeah. routine and stuff like that and sampling the coconut. Yeah. And actually you gotta eat the coconut for it to survive most likely to assist you to go another couple of miles again. Okay? If you shake it, whatever is on the inside is not coconut milk. It's coconut water. Okay? It's clear coconut water. It's very good for dehydration. So if you're out in the wild, you have been traveling for a long time, you will definitely know that most likely dehydration is still in. And if you get coconut, if you drink the water, actually it's helping dehydration. So I'll let you can move on further. After you drink the water, the fleshy part, the edible part is still good to eat. But how are we gonna get there? That's another story. How are we gonna get this off? How are we gonna get the house off? Pardon? Magic. 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 Oh no. I have no magic. Accidentally you have a drill. Electrical okay. drill to so just yeah. make a hole. You have the hard surface there, you can hit it several times on the hard surface. Okay? Okay. That's one way. But in survival you always go the easiest way. That's why it's all about surviving. Right. Okay, even at home you need to know how to survive at home. If the house caught on fire. You live in an elevated building, you need to know how to put some blankets together to get to the window. That's survival. Okay? You're gonna do it this way. As you can see, it's easily cracked around the area here. Okay? You put it down this way, and you take a stone. That's how you're gonna do it. Okay. Alright? Alright. Position yourself. And you have to watch yourself because if you don't hit it properly. Yeah. You're gonna ricochet. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's one of the things I did as a look. Then, Every big step back. go again. Oh, oh there you go. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Good stuff. Like Come on, man. <laughs> one more strike, get up. There you go. Open your legs. Your lift. Move your foot. <laughs> yeah, I'll go in the back. I'm gonna tell you what I'm ready. <laughs> Not too oh, much power. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Don't be too anxious neither. Okay. <laughs> it's all about the technique okay. that you apply. Okay. Now, as you see, you need to drink the water. It's split up already. Yeah. Whatever force you're going to drop on it, not too much. Okay. Okay? Now I'm going to move on. Make sure you watch for your feet. Let's go. Oh. That's it, man. Yeah. Good job. Then you can turn it around and pull it herself. Oh. Yeah. No. You need Give another. Give it down this way. Use your fingers. Like this. To take it up. Yeah. You're just trying to get an extra nut right now. So you kind of did it right <laughs> way. Uh. Use your fingers. Use your fingers. That's it. Little by little. That's it. There you go. Oh, look at that. Nice. Where's your nut? That's your nut, man. Where's yeah. it up? Yeah. No. yeah. It's got an extra nut. <laughs> 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 right? That's a good one. Go. Now, come on, boy. Yeah? You're next. This guy? Okay. Go down this way. Now I'm going to show you how to break it. We don't have knife. We don't have cutlass. We are not with this thing. I'm going to show you how to break it just using what's around you. Okay? I'm going to crack it open for you so it's not too difficult for you. Oh! Oh! Don't okay. worry about the ants. It's nothing. The ants just use it as a home. Oh. There you go. Alright, same thing? Same thing. Watch for the ricochet. Don't worry about the ants. The ants will survive. They'll just find another way to live. Okay. Eye contact right here. Okay. And you drop the spoon right here. Right. Let's go. That's it. Take it off. You see? And turn it over. You're good to go. Take it up.
<laughs> so you're saying to like hey, can you use your fingers now? Yeah, just pluck it out. Use your finger. That's it. Oh, yeah. yeah. <coughs> now with the coconut, coconut, nothing of a coconut throws away. You can use every single part of the coconut. Okay? The husk you have here, you can use the husk to use around your flowers. Okay, to keep the moisture on the flower. Okay, right here, if you want to catch a fire right here, you can use a light or a mat stick. Just like this right here, yeah. you'll get just your flower right there. This here can be also used as a smoke signal and also as a mosquito repeller. Okay, very useful. The shell of the coconut, this shell right here, you can use it to make different stuff. Bags, spurs, belt buckle. You are ready to use that to a lot of cells. Okay? The palm of the coconut, you could use it as decoration for party arrangements, wedding, anniversaries, whatever. You can use it as it because if you're right here and rain is falling, you want to build a house right here, you can use the coconut trunk. The trunk, you use this, the, the trunk as the pillars, the palms, you can use it as a cover, as your garden, or whatever you want to call it. Okay? The rooftop. So. Plenty of uses for coconut, and this is the latter stage of the coconut. Okay, we call it dry coconut right now. Okay, the earlier stage, which is the jelly, you can actually eat the jelly from the actual white. Now, this one here is completely different. So, you heat it up in a circular motion. Wow. <laughs> Alright, here you go. Now, you make little fractures around. It. Yeah, it's got a fracture on it. You can actually eat it like this, if you want to. But I'm going to show you how to get the shell from the flesh. Also, using what's around you, usually you have a knife and put it between here and you'll pluck it off. But you don't have this. How are you going to do it? We're going to show you still how you're going to do it still. Alright? Okay, you like to drink the water? <laughs> Very good. Where's the rub? What small, you can do, you can hit the spoon several times very Rub loosely. If it doesn't come out, we'll also show you how to get it off. Okay? Break it into smaller pieces. So it make it much easier to get it off. Okay, what you're gonna do, you want to get a shell from the fleshy part out. Okay, how are we gonna do it? We don't have a knife, we don't have machete, we don't have no sharp instruments. But we're still gonna do it. Because we want to bite it against our gum to so damage our gum or anything like that. So you put it down, you put it at an angle, and you hit on the shell. Oh, okay. oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you just take it and you just wash it off. Just get the mud out of it. You can go right in the water there and just wash it off. Showing it assist in washing it off also. Can you just give a wash them off?